Good day, everyone. Today, we will be discussing parentheses, multiplication, division, addition, subtraction, or PEMDAS, or grouping, multiplication, division, addition, subtraction, or CHEMDAS. Together, let's make learning mathematics fun and easy. After going through this lesson, you are expected to perform a series of more than two operations on whole numbers, applying parentheses, multiplication, division, addition, or subtraction, or grouping, multiplication, division, addition, subtraction, correctly. To perform a series of operations on whole numbers involving more than two operations using PEMDAS or GEMDAS rules. Rule number one, perform the operations within each pair of groupings, symbols, parentheses, brackets, and braces, beginning with the innermost pair. Rule number two, perform multiplication and division as they occur from left to right. Rule number three, perform addition and subtraction as they occur from left to right. Learning task one. Perform the indicated operations. Twelve plus three minus seven equals to n. Let us first solve the operation inside the parentheses. Twelve plus three equals fifteen minus seven equals eight. N is equals to 8. 4 times 6 plus 8 equals to n. Let us perform the operation inside the column. 6 plus 8 is to 14. 4 times 14 equals to 56. n is equals to 56. 25 divided by 5 plus 9 equals to n. Let us solve division first. 25 divided by 5 equals to 5 plus 9 equals 14. n is equals to 14. 18 minus 4 plus 5 plus 3 equals to n. Let us first add 5 plus 3 equals to 8. Then, 18 minus 4 equals to 14. 14 plus 8 equals 22. N is equals to 22. 6 divided by 3 plus 10 times 3 equals to n. Let us first multiply. 10 times 3 equals to 30. 6 divided by 3 equals to 2. 2 plus 30 equals 32. n is equals to 32. Learning task 2. Perform the indicated operations to solve the following. Twenty minus three plus twelve divided by six times two equals to n. Let us first solve. 12 divided by 6 equals to 2. 
20 minus 3 plus 2 times 2. Then, let us multiply. 2 times 2 equals to 4. Then, copy again. 20 minus 3 plus 4. Let us subtract. 20 minus 3 equals to 17. Then, plus 4. 17 plus 4 equals to 21. Our n is equals to 21. 5 times 9 minus 5 plus 10 equals to n. Let us first multiply. 5 times 9 equals to 45 minus 5 plus 10. Next, let us subtract. 45 minus 5 equals to 40 plus 10. And then, 40 plus 10 equals to 50. N is equals to 50. 20 minus 12 divided by 6 plus 8 equals to N. Let us first divide. 12 divided by 6 equals to 2. 20 minus 2 plus 8. And then, the next operation is subtraction. 20 minus 2 equals to 18 plus 8. 18 plus 8 equals to 26. N is equals to 26. 9 times 9 divided by 3 minus 9 plus 6 is equals to n. Let us first multiply. 9 times 9 equals 81 divided by 3 minus 9 plus 6. Next, let us divide. 81 divided by 3 equals to 27 minus 9 plus 6. Then, let us subtract. 27 minus 9 is equals to 18 plus 6. 18 plus 6 is equals to 24. N is equals to 24. 16 divided by 4 times 5 minus 7 plus 8 is equals to N. First operation is division. 16 divided by 4 is 4 times 5 minus 7 plus 8. Next, let us multiply. 4 times 5 is equal to 20 minus 7 plus 8. 20 minus 7 is equal to 13 plus 8. And then, 13 plus 8 is equal to 21. N is equals to 21. Learning Task 3 Solve the given problems. List down the factors, multiples, and divisibility rules in your notebook. Nine plus two plus three times 21. Let us first solve the parentheses with multiplication. 3 times 21 is equals to 63. Next, 9 minus 2 is equals to 7. 7 plus 63. 7 plus 63 is equals to 70. 70 is our answer. 18 plus 14 plus divided by 6 plus 2. Let us first add 18 plus 14 is equal to 32. Next, 6 plus 2 is equal to 8. 32 divided by 8 is equal to 4. 
four is our answer. Six plus seven times eight. Let us first solve the multiplication. Seven times eight is equals to fifty-six. Six plus fifty-six is equals to sixty-two. Our answer is sixty-two. Twenty-five plus eleven times two. Let us first solve the operation inside the parentheses. 25 plus 11 is 36 times 2. 36 times 2 is equals to 72. 72 is our answer. 3 plus 6 times 5 plus 4 divided by 3. Solve. The operation in the parentheses 5 plus 4 equals to 9 3 plus 6 times 9 divided by 3 next multiplication 6 times 9 is 54 3 plus 54 divided by 3 our next operation is division 54 divided by 3 is equals to 18 3 plus 18 is equals to 21. 21 is our answer. 4 times 15 minus 13 plus 16. Solve the operation inside the parentheses. 15 minus 13 is equals to 2. 4 times 2 plus 16. Next. Let us multiply. 4 times 2 is equals to 8. 8 plus 16 is equals to 24. Our answer is 24. 93 plus 7 times 6 plus 10. Solve. The operation inside the parentheses. 93 plus 7 is equals to 100 times 6 plus 10. Then multiply. 10 times 6 is equals to 600 plus 10. 600 plus 10 is equals to 610. 610 is our answer. 12 times 3 plus 100 divided by 10. So first, the operation inside the parentheses. 100 divided by 10 is to 10. 12 times 3 plus 10. Let us multiply. 12 times 3 is equals to 36 plus 100. 36 plus 10 is equals to 46. 46 is our answer. 14 divided by 2 times 9 divided by 3 times 3. Let us first divide. 14 divided by 2 is 7 times 9 divided by 3 times 3. Then, 7 times 9 is equals to 63 divided by 3 times 3. Three. Then, let us divide again. 63 divided by 3 is equals to 21 times 3. 21 times 3 is equals to 63. 63 is our answer. 16 plus 8 divided by 4 plus 2. Let us first add. 16 plus 8 is equals to 24. Then, 4 plus 2 is equals to 6. 24 divided by 6 is equals to 4. 4 is our answer. 
Thank you for watching. Till our next mathematics lesson. Goodbye.